Hello. Are you ready for our very next animal in the Carnival of the Animals book? I am. So today's is a little different. Today we have personages with long ears. What are those? Donkeys? But wait a minute, I thought we already did donkeys. Let's see. There's a tortoise. We did do donkeys earlier. That's strange. I wonder why he put them in here twice. Donkeys are in our Carnival of the Animals twice. So, on the last time when we did them, do you remember, did our author like donkeys or not like donkeys? Yeah, I don't think he liked donkeys very much. He called them stubborn and said they don't have any manners. And they called them unsavory, which is something that you would consider to be gross. I don't think he liked donkeys. So let's see today what, what he thinks of donkeys. Personages with long ears. They love to loudly bray and bray and bray away both night and day. Determined that their brays be heard, they're both obnoxious and absurd. They bray when it is calm and warm they bray throughout a raging storm to fill the world with coarse hee-haws, sometimes without the briefest pause, appears to be their only cause. Okay, so what do you think? So braying is the sound that a donkey makes, and I bet you know that sound. Hee-haw! Can you do that with me? Hee-haw! <laughs> Silly, right? It's a silly sound and it's kind of annoying, right? It's loud and annoying. So in our music, you're gonna hear beautiful, smooth music sometimes. And then randomly you're gonna hear ding. Every time you hear that ding, I want you to pretend to go, pretend to be a donkey. That's the donkey hee-haw. And you're welcome to crawl around on the floor and do some donkey kicks. But every time you hear that sound, go, you ready? All right, here we go. That one was different and kind of silly too. All right, I hope you enjoyed being a donkey again. I'll see you next time. Bye.